Hi Capri Sons, welcome back to today's video. So the goal for this video is to send a message to my future son and teach him some lessons about how to be a man in this world and make a difference. <gasps> oh, I'm not! Oh, the combo's lit. Introducing my ugly Christmas sweater. This week, there's a special deal going on. Spend 30, get five off. Spend 50, get 10. Spend 100, get $25 off. I love you order now. To get it by Christmas, it's only for this week. I'm officially a dad prawn. Little teasers, you guys love them. So, the first thing, son. Son, wow, that's kind of crazy. Wow, that was a little shock right there. A big thing I've learned, always do one thing each day that scares you. If it's a new trick, if it's talking to a girl, if it's uh, reading a book that is intimidating, you don't think you're gonna get to the end of it, doing a flip for the first time, you do it. You gotta do one thing a day that scares you. Wow, I like this video a lot, this is a good idea. <sighs> Let me put these guys in sports mode. Now we can do something scary. Oh! Okay, that was terrifying. I don't normally do a, that's called like a front to a dive roll. I don't normally do those because it's scary. Okay, so that's my first lesson for you, son. <laughs> I'm giddy right now. This is get, this is making me giddy. Life lesson number two, break a sweat every day. It clears the head. It makes you think clearly. If there's fog, you just go for a run, break a sweat, play some spike ball, some football, play Yu-Gi-Oh cards to get really sweaty because you're scared you're gonna lose. Play some Super Smash Brothers. It's worth it. Break a sweat, son. Number three, be spontaneous. <laughs> you never know when something good's gonna come out of it. Life lesson number four, there's no such thing as mistakes, only lessons to be learned. A little side tip to lesson number four, if you keep receiving these mistakes, then you haven't learned the lesson. So keep trying. Some things are faster than you expect. Always shake a man's hand and look him in the eye. You wanna act like every day there's a camera crew following and you're the star of the movie. When you fall, you gotta get back up. Hey, don't take life too seriously. It's all gonna be okay. Don't forget to dance. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I'm like, life, life lesson number 12. Be Bobby. There's a special lesson I learned from the Australians. It's called the 888 rule. Spend eight hours a day playing, eight hours a day working, and eight hours a day sleeping. Be nice to your siblings. They're the first link to your past, and they'll be there forever. Get to know your parents. You never know when they're gonna be gone. Hi, sweetheart. Hi, mama, how you doing? I'm good. Nice, how's it going? Uh, well, we're getting ready to get on the plane to go to Pittsburgh. Nice, I miss you. How are you doing? I'm doing good. What's up, baby? I was calling you back. Uh, from where? You called me this morning. I did? Uh-huh. <laughs> did your butt do it? I don't know, but hey, my butt misses you. That's all I know. <laughs> Wait, tomorrow it's the halfway point. You're halfway yep. through the pregnancy. Yep, exactly. <laughs> halfway to the pregnancy. You're almost there. That's what she said. Halfway there. Enjoy your body. Use it every way you can. Don't be afraid of it or what people think. It's the greatest instrument you'll ever own. There's a book I read called The Four Agreements. I think this book encompasses how you should live your life. And there's four, the four agreements are always do your best, don't make assumptions, be impeccable with your word, and don't take anything personal. Son, when you meet the love of your life and you go on that first date, if you don't open the door, I'm gonna smack you. <laughs> I, can't I did not in. see that coming. I can't put that in. Son, you wanna respect everyone, especially the women. Make sure you open that door on your first date. Give her a kiss goodnight. Make sure you look them in the eye and be there for them. Men are protectors and that's what we do. Thank you, son, for your time. And my last quote, my last words of advice to give to you is you're gonna forget all of this. We're working hard here at the Funk Bros. Corey's making a treehouse. We're super excited. Hope you guys enjoyed our life lessons and shout out to my son if you're watching this. That's kind of crazy if it's gotten to you by this far. Like this video's been up for that long. 
I'm sure you can only understand all of those by the age of 15. And you'll still forget it all, I bet. I'm not sorry, I'm already throwing shade at my son. I should probably relax. Uh, I roast my son. <laughs> I roasted my future sons. <laughs> A huge shout out to you guys for supporting me, buying my merch, watching my live streams, donating, watching Caper Rydell, watching the Funk Bros. Guys, Rydell and I are gonna be buying our own home soon to start raising our family. That is crazy to me. I There's a point in my life, just a couple of years ago where I didn't want kids and I didn't know where I wanted to go and now I'm here and I never felt so proud of my direction and where I'm going and the people in my life. And another huge shout out to the mob, the people that live in this house. We shoot a reality TV show of all the behind the scenes, the things that we cut out, the things that you never see on anyone's channel. It's on the mob's channel, it's a live, it's a reality TV show of the life of a YouTuber home, of a real group of friends, not just a group of friends that are together because of followers. So I think if you guys check that out, it'll really be worth it as well. Hope you're wearing your ugly Christmas sweater on Christmas. Send me pics, I wanna repost and share some love. Let me put these babies in sports mode. Let's do some tricks. Man, thank you for making this far, guys. If you have, I have a huge question. Guys, do me a favor, comment at the time where you're from and how long you've been watching me and the Funk Bros. I'm curious because you see this thing right here? This is a scooter. This is the reason why Corey and I are doing YouTube for a living. This is our main passion. This is the reason why we're here today because we were so lucky enough to have a niche talent and go onto YouTube with such small competition that we were able to blow up. And then we took advantage of that blow up because we are making content that was fun. I've always been a trampolinist, a gymnast, and a scooter rider, so this combo is very near and dear to my heart. So thank you guys for watching. I'm not sure if there's any OGs out there who've been watching since 2016 when Corey and I posted our first, when Corey and I posted our first video, which was us riding our scooters in our front yard at the Funk Bros old house where my mom and dad used to live, our big yellow house. I'm sure all you guys remember. Oh, wow, I'm insane, right? You know, son, this is sort of me talking to myself in the future once. I watched this video with my son, and it's just crazy to see where we've gone. Your support has been so immense and overwhelming, and every day, I'm not kidding, I wake up and I, and I say to myself, wow, how did I get here? I'm so thankful to be here, and you guys are the reason. So let's get Lady Titty up in here, y'all. Oh yeah, guys, also another fun little fact, there's a trick named after me. Someone I look up to, his name's Jesse Carter, he named this trick after me because I did it in an edit back in 2018. That's called the Capron Flip. I made it up. And the people named it after me, which is crazy because I never asked for that. It just happened. Capron doing the Capron? Capeception. Luckily, everything you're seeing here on the Capron channel, a little sneak peeks of what's going on at the Funk Bros, but I can't show you everything. We're just going to do a little glimpse of what we're doing, but really quick. Show them real quick. Okay. That's all you get to see, guys. This is my message to my future son, and this is a whole, this is, this is just a couple things I want him to learn. Is it literally man. just gonna be called message to my future son? Yeah, something like that. Dope. So it's really fun. So when I'm reviewing this with my son, when he's old enough to comprehend everything, I don't know, I was just saying thank you to the scooter industry and the funk bros, you and I, you're the, you are one of the main reasons why we're here today, doing what we're doing, and this is our job, to yeah. build psycho stuff and play around. No, like, I'm just I, I totally agree, I think that's, I think it's awesome that we did all those things, and we did all those amazing things. Um, and it took a lot of effort to get here, a lot of work. Yeah. On both our ends. When I came through and you came through, we've supported each other to get where we are today. Yeah. Yeah. You missed a little bit of scruff to shave. I'm gonna remember that now. All right, love this you. This is an Easter egg. Easter egg. Tapefunk.com. Oh, I landed it, shoot. <laughs> when you're just too good at life, there are no lessons. <laughs>